Hey, lords and ladies of the internet! I am your glorious, magnificent, Grand Master Admiral of the internet! And I welcome you back to my glorious station of Halcon 6! Now, what are we doing this week? Well, for a start, we need to go collect this Pillar of Zargon thingy! as well as save the consensus from their inevitable demise at the hands of this thing, which we're going to see appear, and the, they're going to beg for our help in three, two, one... Human friend. Greetings, alien! I knew you'd be calling! Our people have been overwhelmed by the sheer psychic force of a nearby fleshy titan of a vessel. We admit now we were fools to believe that our impeccability evolved empath neurometers could shield us from the hellish nightmare projections of the cruel. We figured if such a cranially insubstantial race such as yourselves could resist them, it would be a cinch for us. What the hell did you mean by that? That's quite insulting right there. How about we upload you some of the information on how to defeat them? Hmm. Now let me guess. Now you need us to save you. Yes, exactly. Why, maybe the horse and gis gift is rubbing off on you after all. No, not really. You're just that bleeding obvious, you weakling alien scum. Quick, what am I thinking, uh, thinking now? Come. Give it a try. I am utterly desperate at this point. My race will soon be extinct. I am utterly desperate at this point. Oh, that was way off. Wow, never mind. In any case, the answer is most assuredly yes. We need your aid. Hmm... Should I? Perhaps we'll save you. Perhaps we won't. Maybe we'll meditate on it. Oh, I so feel like saying that. But I do love killing the cruel. We'll do everything in our power to save Onur from this attack. Fantastic. One second. There. I've transmitted your response to the Prime Consensus. The ones that aren't currently jabbering incoherently are greatly reassured. We await your arrival, human friend. I'm sure you do. I'll be there in maybe 30 days. Okay? Okay. First up, yes, that's what I needed to do. I needed to finish that little task there. Next, I'm going to go save your colony. Because I have to do everything for you little whores and people, don't I? Right then. Let's go save their colony. Bye-bye! One is dead. Wow, that almost did an amount of damage which I care about. Almost. Oh, that was a glorious amount of damage. Do you know what it means, though? It means you are more than likely dead. I really don't want to heal you right now because you got so much health. So I'm just going to sideswip it. Ah, magnificent. The battle is won. We have saved the Horzen. We don't need your materials. Our economy is booming. And seriously, we have too many. But I wonder what I should do now. I could go save Onir immediately. But I feel I should need to go and rescue this pillar thing. So you know what? To hell with it. I'm not scared of cruel space. What's in this pillar? Commander, we've managed to track down the pillar of Zargon to our, to our Horzen crash site. We can attempt to ground rescue to, it, to recover it. Okay. Then do that. Go, outsider, go. Save the pillar of Zargon for our Horzen friends. Commander, our recovery team has been approached by Hungry Cruel. They'll need to fight off 
to protect the pillar. No matter! I have full confidence in my army's ability to deal with a few cruel. Oh, look, they're young crew. Oh, wait, one's young and two of them are adults. They're not even ancient. You know, like the things that actually attack our damn base. I was almost scared that I might actually have to deal with something that is in any way damaging. I'm glad I don't. Oh, you're going rabid. That's cute, because you know what? You're kind of dead. We killed the baby. It's nice and dead now. Now to kill the last adult. Now, before anything, I must ask, outsider, are you feeling okay? I mean, you took a whole seven damage in that fight. Uh, do you need to lie down or something? Commander, our fleet has successfully orchestrated the recovery of the Pillar of Zargon. The Horzen will be pleased with its return. I'm glad to hear it. We just have to go back to Anir. Oh, that's the Tier 5... Whatchamacallit, wasn't it? Yeah, this is the Tier 5... Uh, whatchamacallit... Uh, fighty Starship, which I was creating. Yeah, okay. Commander, the Yabbling Alliance raid fleet has entered Leo and is raiding the Horse and Consensus facility. If we don't interfere, it might be destroyed. What is wrong with the Yabblings? What do they possibly have against the Horsen? What does everyone have against the Horsen? There's nothing else for me really to do other than to go and kill this thing, is there? Hmm. And it's not immune to to run engines down either. None of, ne none of them are. So you know what? I think it's time for us to go kill more whales so that we can upgrade our, our precursor ship a little better. We need to kill quite a few space whales. But I am not scared. I feel fine with this. Off you go, my wonderful soldiers. You can kill those mighty space whales, can't you? Kill the whale! That's not a dead whale. Hmm, okay. That ship might need a little bit of health. Maybe. Probably not. <sighs> I enjoy killing aliens so much. Okay, I think you might accept that heal now. Just because it looks like you're in need of it. Now that looked big and mighty, and I love the look of it. The colony is safe once more from the evil space whales. Yes, I'm sure it is. Come, soldier. Come, my lovely combatants. There is more space whales for us to kill. Ow! Almost ow. I didn't like getting hit by that evil, evil space whale! That space whale doesn't sound very happy. It seemed to be making very weird beepy noises then. I think we should put it out of its misery, just to make sure it doesn't suffer anymore. Hmm, none of them are good at having their engines removed. That's not very nice of them. Hmm, it is starting to begin to look like I could use a heal. Yeah, like this. That works. Hey, can you e kill the evil space whale now? Ooh, so close. But don't worry, this will put it out of its misery. I thought that attacked everyone. Oh well, this will attack everyone. Ah, wonderful and dead. Hey. That wasn't very nice. 
I mean, I we instantly healed all the damage you just dealt to us, and then you bled out. But still, that wasn't very nice. Space whales go die, die. Space whales go die, die. Space whales gotta die, die. Oh, right. A bunch of you were tier four, weren't you? You evaded? Ooh, one shot. That's what we like to see. The enemy being one shot. This thing has evaded two attacks in a row now. I'm beginning to hate it. That's what I like. That's also what I like. Go die, miserable space alien scum. Hmm. Lose your engine, space whale. And your sensors. You are going to get rammed. And then you are going to get battered. And then you are going to die. Oh yes, you are most certainly going to die. Um, miserable space alien. I think you're dead. Well and truly. I hope living wasn't in your plans for the future. Bye bye, alien! Ah, we now have every alien artifact available to us. Perfect. Now, I would go an upgrade if it wasn't for the fact I don't have time. Commander, it appears another collective fleet has been taken over by the Cruel and it's currently headed our way. Really? The Cruel have inter intercepted one of our Starbase hangars. Really? They just can't wait, can they not? Well, everyone is here and waiting now. So I guess I should send in Zhao. You know, because Zhao is the one in charge of, you know, getting us healed. Alright, everyone. I hope we're ready. You two had better get used to Zhao. She's soon gonna be your the replacement. Ooh, it has two HP left. That's just not fair. I guess I'll have to do this. Just to give us more aim and more damage and more everything. Um, I hope you didn't enjoy living. Because you're not anymore. And that thing now has damage resist. That's just not nice, pal. You like resisting every effect, don't you? I mean, you're just not being very nice right now. But I guess that doesn't matter if we still can kill you. All the same. I have seven days to return this pillar. I think I need to just head over to the place now and go kill that big cruel overlord quite frankly it just seems like something that needs to happen now because we're running out of time oh I have a lot of options now the colossal crew desolator in orbit around Anir barely takes notice of your fleet seemingly content to munch on the fallen ships That was weird. I just wanted to retreat so I could remove the big thing on the left of my screen. You don't need to be a prick. And I have to go fight the cruel again. <sighs> I'll be right back. You know, I think I preferred these enemies. They're nowhere near as powerful. And they like to die a bit. Also, you may want to heal yourself. You were looking a little low. 
Alright, go Falcon punch it. There we go. Nice and dead. You know, maybe that was the problem. I didn't Falcon punch it at the end of the last one. Alright, let's go kill the big evil crew now without this being up here. What's attacking something? Oh, the crew are attacking the cons the collective. Oh, I guess I should go kill them later. The colossal crew desolator in orbit around and near barely takes notice of your fleet, seemingly content to munch on the fallen ships. Inject bio-agent into passing de debris. Circulate a memo on the young rate on the circulate a memo on the race you are saving. State that stare at the crusher intently. Ha. Huh. I don't know which one is what. So I think bio agent into Wonderful, simply wonderful, Commander. The entire Horzen Consensus was supporting you throughout your trials to recover this most august of artifacts. And now, with it safely back in our hands, we can re return it to its proper place. Storage Unit Z76FFQ5421S, never to be gazed upon again. Ha! Huh. Alright. Oh, so you're immune to ship resistance, which you would be anyway, because you're a boss. Meaning you don't have any resistances at all in your current location. Oh, this is just magnificent, isn't it? Well, I guess the way we should always start these things is basically by ramming one of them to death. Isn't that right, Isadile? You, it survived! Is a dial! Are you feeling okay? Oh wow, your big mighty ray gun totally did anything to me, didn't it? Ha ha ha, no. All I need to do is dot you with every single dot I can get. Because you have this annoying little damage limit on you. Meaning, there's a limit to how much damage I can deal to you in a single attack. But unfortunately, there is no limit to how many uh, damage over time effects I can apply to you. Which, in other words, is the plan. I mean, in the end, isn't it rather cute how many, uh, you know, massive attack... Uh, damage about boost things you have on you at the moment. I think it is. You know, Mr. Big Giant Cruel Overlord, I have to admit, this has been rather sad. I was expecting a little more. Bye 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 Wow, that was pathetic. All hail the saviour of the Hosen. All over or near, Hosen are psychically pinny pinging one another madly to determine who delivered them from their pe penury. Who has arrested the diabolical voice in our heads? And clear as the skies over or near, the answer thunders across the consensus. The brave human commander who most val validly risked the lives of their human underlings by dispatching them across great distances to save us. In thanks for this unprecedented act of kindness, we have prepared an equally unprecedented gift in exchange. The Geodastic Amplifier. Add it to your hulking precursor structure. It is sure to unlock great powers Though, fun story, the Cruel did seem to use the amplifier to cause all that aform psychic distress. But we're sure it won't affect you the same manner though, seeing as you aren't psychic, like we are. In fact, we foresee it won't be a problem in the slightest. Very well! You'd hate the Cruel! 
That's most appropriate, considering we do nothing but kill them all the time. You might want to get back and make sure we can, you know, save our little base from being bombarded now. Hello, collective ships. You are very cute. Hmm. I'm never quite sure which abilities I should use first with the dial. She doesn't actually have that many available to her. Oh my, what a cute little amount of damage you sustained. Shut up. One collective ship down to the count. Just a few more to go. Bye bye. You survived. I'm impressed. You're not, that's not gonna save you. Well, you're now just one hit away from death. So it's only appropriate that from your one hit away from death, we just do it with one hit. Bam. Bye bye. Nice and dead. Magnificent. Well, now we can focus a little on upgrading our precursor ship with that massive bonuses we just got. So, outsider, off you go. Start preparing. You know what? Because we're doing that, we might as well do some tier 5 hangar upgrades, too. It's only appropriate. Commander, the Collective has contacted us to request our aid regarding some possessed feats in their territory. We should def dispatch a fleet to, to transest this immediately. The Horsen have delivered the Geometic Amplifier. Excellent. What do I need to up to learn about it? A, a few days, apparently. Because apparently it's a tactical bonus. Huh. I guess I should wait for Outsider. Outsider, teach me about the thing that the, the Horsen just delivered to us. Meanwhile, we'll superpower the rest of our ships. Yes, I acknowledge it. Next up. Commander, the facility at Alpha Dalphi is under attack by Ma Didn't I murder all the Valashi aliens? We have successfully researched the geometic out amplifier. Perfect. Where can I shove it? I can only I can't shove it anywhere right now. So we're just going to wait for the build, for us to clear out some space to build it. There we go. And now we're going to start building it. What is it? The Horsen have refused to acknowledge how exactly they came into possession of this artifact. But the Geomestestic Amplifier has clear affiliations with the Halcon 6 station. Once serving as a kind of central nervous system for the station. Plus 20% resistance against combat status effects. Oh my, that sounds amazing. We're also only two big sets away of star... Of space aliens away from murdering everything. Nice. You know what? Newbie fleet. No, we're not sending the paladin this time. We have a new ship. The ninja. Now, if we send the this this set of people against the the aliens, the space whales, we'll get them a little bit of experience, which is magnificent. Now, what are these things all weak to? Is the question. That will do for tactics. I've had enough. Right. So, how are we going to start this? That is simple. We are going to start by blinding it. Ow. Ow. I may have underestimated the might of space aliens. Hmm. There we go. That's nice and saved there. You're going to heal yourself up. Hmm. I've never had such challenges outside of when I'm fighting with these people. That's not so bad. 
That's a little worse. In fact, that's a mighty bit worse. Have I gotten possibly a little too used to having the big ultra mega ship? Maybe. I'm glad I have a superpower person. Because that superpower may be a little needed at times. What the blazes can I do to you? This. Still didn't kill. It evaded. How dare it evade? It has like no health left. And that's dead. Glorious. Okay. That's a one down and gone. That's two down and gone. I don't understand why you were acting out on your own then, people. You weren't panicked. There we go. It's magnificently dead. We have some more relics for ourselves now. Well done, people. Please return home with the scrap you call ships. Meanwhile, I'm going to send the proper fleet against the big things that are invading us. Please don't tell me you're healing yourself. That would be quite annoying. You're invigorated. Hmm, that's just as annoying, actually, actually. But no matter. It won't make a difference in saving your miserable lives. You are all still going to die. And how soon isn't even a question. It's going to happen like that. Why aren't the Volash extinct? I'm pretty sure I killed them all last week. I am very confused by this right now. You know, there's not really much of anything left for me to do. Other than to just have is a Zao just, you know, explore every room left. And why Zhao? So that Zhao can level up and become a level 13. So that she can command our stuff. Or she can just go help, go over here and help command, destroy these. But then again, we actually got blown out the water practically last time. The geometric amplifier is now online. Glorious. The colony was obliterated. I don't care. I am fed up with doing stuff for you ga damn guys. Oh right, I should probably go help the collective over here. It appears another collective fleet is on it has been controlled. Why? Why? Commander, we're getting... That the collective colony of Corvus has been destroyed by the cruel. What? I still had another few days before then. Commander, our sensors have detected the largest cruel super vessel we've seen yet. Our team is starting to worry that there may be no limit to the size of vessel they can spawn. You're all cowards. Commander, that we, we're getting collect that the cruel collective place was destroyed by the cruel. And I was about to go save the collective after dealing with the, their collect their own ships. How irritating can you get? Harmonious systems, bonus speed, bonus aim, and bonus damage. Hmm. That's quite the annoying little thing you've just done. I, funny enough though, I'm not impressed. In the slightest. 
by any of your silly little maneuvers. Because my ships are just superior in every way. But I should probably go and destroy these things over here. I mean, it's only right that I go bail out my alien allies every space that I can, isn't it? Come at me, aliens! I am not afraid. I am more than willing and prepared to engage you in glorious, magnificent combat. You resisted. How dare you resist? Then again, I guess it doesn't even matter because of how little health you have. Oh, maybe it does, and I can stand corrected. Huh. One day, the cruel might become threatening. And on that day, I look forward to that day. Because that day, they may provide a challenge. Now, I don't want to fight this lot, because I'd like the newbie crew to fight them. But I don't have a choice, considering the pair of them spawn together for some reason. Like, how inconvenient must you make yourself? It's just rude, you know? Look, I'm not even letting you have attack. Or maybe you do get an attack, because I forgot about the fact you're immune to ship disabled right now. But you're not going to live! You are certainly, most certainly, getting overkilled. Right then. What do I need to get my last remaining requirements for my... To finally get my final upgrade for my Vindicator here. And the answer is just these last remaining space whales. Behemoths! Obliterate these cute guys. I really don't know why you call them cute. Ah, what a cute little ram you just did on us. Let me show you a real ram. That's a real ram. See the damage difference? No, you don't, cause you're dead. Oh, magnifique! What kind of damage do you call that? And why can't you do it normally? I think you're dead now. Bye bye, space whale. My, I just don't know how to react to these things anymore because everything just simply dies. By the way, where's that big evil cruel thing? I'd assume it would be heading over to the Tsar, but I got two days to get over there. I don't think that's happening. Mostly because I didn't realize it was under attack. Man, these aliens really need to look, learn to look after themselves a little. How about you go die? Oh my goodness. 11,000 damage? Even I think that's a little excessive. That's the last of the space whales. Now then. I guess the only thing left to do is go and try and save the cruel. Or the yabberlings from the cruel, I should say. Why would I save the cruel? I don't like the cruel. And we arrived just in time to save the miserable little swamp dwellers. Ah, perfect. What isn't perfect is the fact they're all immune to losing their, uh, their bloody weapons. Or engines. Mostly because of the space station we're in. Hmm. Aren't the enemies cute? They in any way think they can live. When I can just do crap like that. Ah. Ah. Not many left to kill left. I seem to have murder down to a T on how to perform it properly. Is all I can say. Here's the cruel behemoth thing. I am sure we will go kill it next week. But first, I suppose I should keep defending the yabberlings from the last final assault. 
Your space exploration team has encountered a Grombolos. While coordinating an expedition ex exploration expedition, Zhao senses a Gorbulus hidden nearby. These disgusting semi-psychic creatures are known to attempt to wrest control of the minds of their prey and must be rooted out immediately before it attempts a psychic attack on Zhao. Then fire wildly in his direction! Without warning, their cadets start firing starts firing up where the Gorbula seems to be. Unfortunately, the confused cadets, not knowing what to do, join in the badly planned attack. Many hit each other by accident. Why do I hire these idiots? An adult Gobulus Overseer. Hmm. Sounds pretty bad. Go slice it up! And then battle sims ourselves. I don't think your scream did anything. Oh no, Zhao got a little injured. Oh, that's annoying and evil. Go die! How do you want to kill it? You want to go slice it up? Go ahead! Nice job! Nice job! Nice and dead! And it, we're here ready to kill the evil space aliens! Ha! Ah, magnificent! I think I'll kill you! You resisted the effect! Of course you would resist the effect. Ooh, you're looking a little worse for wear right now. You know what? I think I will actually heal you. Which is an un very u unusual concept for me. Healing my people. Normally they're above needing healing. Ah, they're nice and panicked. Do you know what that means? I think it means you're a little... Alive? What? Get sideswiped, you annoying little critter. How dare you survive? We don't need your reward. We really don't. We have 30,000 of everything apart from fuel. And the only reason I don't have more fuel is because I can't be bothered to make more fuel. We've almost cleared out our little place here. But you know what else? I'm afraid I'm all out of time for today's episode. So everyone, what can I say other than thank you all for joining me this week. I have been your mighty magnificent host, the Parafox Archangel, the English gentleman of the internet of outer space. And I hope to see you all again next week. But I'm afraid that until then, it is time for me to bid the all farewell, good day, and finally, good night.